How's it going guys? Welcome to Nautilus. Today we're going to be talking about the Hammerhead Evolution E2. Uh, so if you come closer, I'll give you guys a quick little run through on this gun right here. Uh, well, this is the, uh, the new model in comparison to the original Hammerhead Evolution. We'll start over here at the muzzle. Um, as you can see, they, they are still using the open muzzle setup, which is pretty sweet. Keeps your, uh, you know, gives you a nice line of sight and the shaft is nice and uh, keeps the shaft nice and, and smooth there on the rail. Uh, has a two band setup. I believe these are 14 millimeter bands with the uh, loop system so you can interchange your Dyneema wishbones as you please. On the bottom of the muzzle you'll notice it has a line guide so if you guys like using a reel or whatnot you can run your Spectre or Dyneema right under here and it keeps it nice and close to the barrel so it causes a little bit less drag uh, than you would with, uh, with a different kind of muzzle. Uh, the shaft is a uh, spring steel uh, Hawaiian flopper setup with a pencil point tip and uh, well, as we work our way down here on the uh, actual gun, uh, you'll notice that's the rail right there, nice deep groove, which is real nice. On the back here, the uh, they're still using the pins, which uh, helps um, keep those wishbones, uh, excuse me, keep those wishbones alive. Um, and the handle, which is something I really like about this gun, it has a pretty cool feature. You can actually adjust the trigger sensitivity, which is pretty pretty nice. Some people like heavy pull. Other guys like a light pull, so it's kind of nice uh, that you can adjust that. They give you that option. Has the side line release in comparison to the old model, which had the bottom line release, which is pretty nice. Uh, Safety is easy to get to. Um, you know, no, no, nothing crazy about that. Um, and what's really cool about it is the grip that the gun uses. Uh, you'll notice here that the grip is actually formed uh, to fit your hand uh, pretty well, so it's kind of grooved. So when you grip it, it gives you a real nice, comf uh, comfortable grip, which is something I actually really like about uh, I really like about the gun. Another feature they added was the uh, reel mounting bracket, so no more drilling into your barrel. If you want a reel, you just slide it on here. Rob Allen reels fit on it. The Hammerhead Remora reel uh, fits on it. So you have uh, you have a few uh, different options you can go with. Has the uh, loading butt integrated into the uh, into the back of the gun, and aside from that, it's a pretty nice uh, pretty nice looking rail gun. Has some pretty modern features, very Euro style, and and what can I say? I think Hammerhead did a great job of upgrading their old model. And if you guys want to take a look, you can check out the link on the bottom. Uh, you'll see it up on our website. And uh, and uh, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next one.